Hello, folks, and welcome back to Jupiter Hell. Let's jump into a run. We did Marine last time. Let's go ahead and do... Let's just go down the list. Let's do Scout now. Bottom of the Universe, who are we naming this run after? Bottom of the Universe is randomly selected. Monte plays games. Thank you for the subscription on YouTube. Do you appreciate that? I don't like the looks of this. Okay, so as a scout, of course, we start with a 44. And we get the ability to do stealth, theoretically. I say theoretically, because it only sometimes comes up. At least with the 44, we have a better chance of actually killing these guys in a single blow. Oh, and also apparently being armed by them, so that's cool. Uh, I probably don't want that, though. Let me go ahead and switch back over there. Yeah. So unfortunately, we're not going to get very much out of the 44. Uh, yeah, we can only carry two guns until we get Hoarder. Actually, might not be a bad idea. I keep doing that, though. Oh, okay. okay hunker down and wait for a good shot. And there's this guy over here. And you have a shotgun, Clear. but now you're dead. All right, I'm going to take Hoarder. And I keep doing that every time, but it works out so well. I think we're going to take a melee weapon. In place of... And we could just pick it up. Hardly ever use a shotgun, so maybe that's just where we leave it. Yeah, so no shotguns, so no shotgun shells. Two red key cards, sure, why not? And that looks like it. Okay. With stealth, we should be able to make the melee work. That's the hope, anyway. Oh, good. Make it. We need that. Should be who able needs to. Light anyway. Okay. Well, yeah. Who needs light? Should be able to sneak up on somebody, stab them through the throat. We do get a critical bonus, I think. Just make sure we're loaded up and ready for bear here, just in case. Love to be able to turn on the light. I mean, it is nicer being closer to the character like this. Oh right. The fiends, for some reason, always take two shots, regardless. Thank you, so you might as well have the 9mm. Oh, okay. I'm dropping an auto rifle immediately. That's actually very helpful. That means the 44 is only really going to be useful for fiends, or maybe not fiends. Um, grunts. That was risky. He could have shot at me and blown me up, but fortunately it didn't happen. But it was risky. Where's this go? Done Callisto mines pretty recently. I think we. Oh, hello. Um, stealth me here. Okay, hunker down. Okay, definitely need to use that med kit. I walked right in front of that, and there was no reason to do that. I was trying to be fast. Oh, hunter rifle, that'd be a good upgrade. Thank you. Yeah, there was no need to be fast there. Ah, sure, I'll take a smoke grenade. What the hell? And the hunter rifle could be helpful. We'll see. I don't really have a lot of good sidelines here, especially in the dark. Yeah, 9mm there is probably the right thing to do. And there should be another one. There we go. Okay, we've got two more guys. Wait for the good stuff. Come on, you saw me here, right? Maybe you didn't. Maybe you didn't actually see me. Okay, well, pop this open. Only he didn't see me either. I'm amazed at our luck, basically. Yeah, totally worked out. Uh, scavenger's a thought. We'll get a lot of 44 ammo that way. Guess what do we need here? Ghost might be okay. Assassinate, I've been told, is bad. And I can see why. Because teleporting behind somebody sounds awesome. But I can't even number the amount of times that we've been surprised that there's somebody behind the person we can actively see. So we teleport behind them. Doesn't that put us in a terrible, terrible spot? Possibly even getting surrounded? Like, this seems like a bad idea. If you know what you're going into, it's fine. But I can imagine this getting us killed as often as it looks cool. So, no. Gun Runner might be okay. 
50 attack time. Okay, so basically we attack faster. That might be okay. Gun Kata might be better, though. Gunslinger requires us to keep a pistol on us all the time, though. Uh, let's see. SMGs or revolvers. Okay, so as long as it's an SMG or revolver, we're actually going to upgrade an SMG pretty soon. Though, think about later on, right? Like, if we go to IO, assuming that even happens, the plasma weapons would basically have to be a plasma pistol. I guess if the weapon in sequentially in your equipment matches, you'll fire both of them with minus one off distance penalty. So basically, we could dual wield plasma pistols in later levels. Okay, we can try Cinema again. Yeah, gain bonus to pistol ranges, including revolvers. Okay. So maybe that means we switch over. In which case, maybe we switch the combat knife. So now we have two pistols. Okay, now we have two pistols. One on two and one on three. Um, which won't matter yet until we get to level 10. So actually, we don't even need to do that, do we? Yeah, let's grab the combat knife right now. Because I don't need to do this until we actually get Gunrunner. Okay, so the combat knife for now, but... For right now, 9mm pistol is apparently the way to go. Seems weird leaving the auto rifle there, but we'll try this out. Like, they do drop decent combat pistols every once in a while, so it's it's worth doing, possibly. Or restoring the power is not worth it, I don't have the most tool anyway. Hoping to find something cool here, but I don't think we're going to do that quite yet. So do I want to go to the special area? I guess I should look at the recon. What special areas are we talking about here? Mines, Rift, Habitat, and Docking Bay. So we can try Docking Bay? I don't think I've ever tried that before. It's probably even more dangerous, but maybe it'd be fun. Okay, this goes level 3. Okay. Do we have anything special over here? No. Double checking. Keep wanting to pick up those auto rifles. I'm so used to doing that, but we're going to hold off. We do have the Hunter Rifle, which should help us. We don't exactly have a Sniper skill, but it still works out. And what do you know? It dropped off from 44. But as long as we get range here, and actually this is well lit, so we should be able to be totally fine here. So we're backing up here. I'm burning a little bit, but that's okay. Hunker down. Take the bot out first. Wait for a good shot. There you go. Okay. These guys are just walk into my kill zone. I'm totally fine with that. Yeah, if I hadn't had the hunter rifle there, we would definitely be in a more problematic position for sure. They're right at the edge of my kill zone. Which is perfect. Okay, so the 9mm pistol, change out for the AV1. And what do we got? Bonus damage after kill, sure. Sure, why not? Why not? Computer down there, I don't think that's gonna give me anything good. We could actually we don't even have the most tools to even use. So even if I wanted to get recon data, we can't even do it. Nobody? Nobody around here at all? I hear growling. Where's the growling coming from? Try down here. Well, that's where we came in. And that's just a door. Okay, there we go. He's not dead. There's no way. I don't believe it. And I was right not to believe. Right at the edge of my kill zone here? Come on. 60%? Really? Okay. He's gonna make me do this. He'll... Burst at the boxes eventually. Maybe. Or he'll forget about me. One of the two. Take the 60. There we go. Like I said, he's going to burst through the boxes eventually. Fire fiends, no worry. I don't even know if we need the 9mm ammo. With just a single combat pistol, I don't know if it's going to be worth it. 
I guess we use scavenger, maybe. We'd have to get the scavenger perk, of course, but... Uh, we should probably just repair our armor. There you go. I honestly don't know if the smoke grenade is going to be worth it, but I'll take it. That's how we do things downtown. Okay, so that's our exit to the Callisto Hub, which I guess we take. Um, there was a special exit somewhere. I want to make sure I'm not taking the special exit. Callisto Rift, okay. Yeah, we don't want to go there. Well, I'm a little worried about the amount of ammo we have for the Hunter Rifle, so Scavenger might not be a bad idea. I mean, the sniper rifle's doing really good, but let's go ahead and take Scavenger. That way we can trade any ammo we want for basically anything we have. Whoops, okay. Switch over to... Slot number two. Okay. Could be worse. Somebody coming over this way, maybe slot number three. No, slot number one, like it. Okay, let's just go ahead and trade this ammo here. Thank you. There's nothing here. Yeah, take some cover here, just in case. There's no way he's dead with this needle shot. There's no way that happened. There we go. I hear growling over maybe destruction. That is a special door. We don't want to go there. 10 millimeter. Yeah, not worth it. No perks on it. There's no reason to take it. Is it might have additional damage on it. I suppose I should verify that. Yeah, okay. What the hell? We'll verify it. Okay, it does do more damage. Does not have a frenzy, but does do 18 damage. It does use two bullets to do it, so it's an auto combat pistol, basically, but that could be okay. I mean, only two more damage, but sometimes it's that extra two damage that could really help out. So we'll try it out. Oh, well, health's a good idea. Uh, maybe another med kit? Yeah, I could use another med kit. Actually, let's trade a multi-tool for another med kit. At least I have a stack of med kits. It's something. Not a lot, but it's something. You're growling, but I don't know where it's coming from. There's got to be a bunch of fiends around here somewhere. Oh, guards. Eh, about the same thing. <sighs> These guys are accurate, so the sooner I take them out, the better. Mm, they're bleeding. 36. Oh, make them come to me. Might need a med kit right now. Be on the safe side. No fucking ammo. Reload. Okay, hunker down. <clears throat> Reload. 30%'s not gonna do it though. Now you pull back. Crap. Nope, that wasn't it. That wasn't it. Unfortunately the auto the um being super accurate didn't help me out at all. Alright, so let's go and do a new run here. Set bot of the universe up so I know that's gonna happen. And let's do another another scout. Part of the universe's randomly selected Spyfire 242. Oops, I can spell today. Okay. Thank you for the subscription the on YouTube. We appreciate that. Oops. Haha. <laughs> had the wrong button selected. So we have a name for the next run. So I had the intro button down there, but we'll see. Hopefully we don't need it for this episode, though. Oh, hey there, guys. Uh, hunker down here. Whoops. Oh, you first. Uh, maybe you're going to be a better shot? Yeah, there you go. And then you... Nope, that's not going to work. Okay, pull you down here, so you have to come to me. And then wait. He was firing at me. There we go. Okay, grab the combat knife. Switch back over. Maybe actually a hunker here, so they come a little closer. There. Okay. We only got a couple of guys left, but we might be able to level up here. Let me get a hoarder and take our another weapon. I don't know if I want the 9mm necessarily, but it might be the way to go. Rinse. Okay, Repeat. so we get hoarder. Go with the 9mm. 
Uh, no shotgun shells for me, but the helmet is much appreciated. Make sure we're not missing any boxes, but it doesn't look like we are. Okay, pick up some 9mm ammo just to be on the safe side. That's probably going to be our lives, really, is 9mm all the time. And if we can find a sniper rifle, great. But right now it's not looking too likely. I don't know, mostly because I, I died to stupid reasons on that last run. So I'm not feeling great about my life choices right now. But... Oh, shit. Spot. And we're running. Actually, stealth. That's what I should have done, is stealth last time. Okay, we're no longer stealth. We don't need to be. Now they all know I'm here. He has an SMG. That might be worth going for. I can't see shit. Okay, good. Pick up the SMG. It's going to burn through a lot of ammo, but it might be worth it. Unfiend actually nailed me there. Good job. I mean, I'm mad, but I'm also like, I can't be mad, right? Like, that was just a good shot. Thought I heard a turret there, but maybe not. There's a lot of explosive barrels around here, though. Okay, hunker down here, though they're going to be able to get to me. I think hunker here over here. Yeah, there we go. Make them come to me. We need stacks and stacks and stacks of 9mm. And it's only really going to happen if the gods smile on us, basically, which is not really likely right now. He might break his own cover, but I don't think we can depend on it. Out of ammo, reload. Yeah, 12% is really not going to cut it. Oh, the time I'm actually we managed to make that work. Yeah, leave the combat pistol there until we decide what uh, special class we want to use. Though, doing Gunrunner might still be fun. I'm just not going to get it yet. I just destroyed my cover, huh? Um, I think we already have a helmet, right? Yeah, we do. But it's pretty bad, so trade it out. Don't want to use the multi tools for it yet. We'll get there. Not there yet. A friend, thank you. For now. Okay. It's level two. Let's not go to this. Well, I guess we should look to see what the special areas are. What's our options? Mines, terminal, rift, and docking bay. And we just we haven't been to the docking bay. I don't think. I don't think we've ever actually been that patient. So let's try it out. Just gotta get to level five without, you know, dying. Which is harder than it seems sometimes. He's gonna take cover there, but if I come over here. I thought I was gonna be able to flank him. Oh, there we go. Mm, your shotgun has a wider range than I like, but you should be able to know I'm here. Yeah, there we go. 48, huh? I'll take a 65. Nice. We're gonna got a friend over there. A lot of friends everywhere. What about you? I don't have good shots on either one of you, but I'll take the 65. Right up until you blew my cover. Okay, well, they're going to come to me now. Which might actually have been better. Okay. Scavenger is a thought, but I think we want Son of a Gun again. It does increase pixel... Pixel? Pistol. I guess pixels are made of pistols, or one of the two. At least in this game. Okay, you're going to be right there. Let me just blow you up. Makes my life a lot easier. That wasn't everybody, apparently. Do I want to trade over to a pistol? It's a thought. Especially the 44 revolvers right there, but I don't know. I mean, it's, it's silly to say that that's what got me killed last time, but it feels like that's what got me killed last time. I mean, I know it makes no sense. Need to reload. Get back up here while we reload. Uh, maybe even stealth while we reload here. The fiends are going to be able to tell where I am. Now that we've revealed ourselves. Okay. Is the fiend still alive? We have a sniper rifle option now. 
grunt there with a pistol is not really going to be able to get a good beat on me. There. Okay, so we got to trade the revolver for the sniper rifle. Tempted to trade the SMG. I think the SMG gets a bonus too. I mean, I guess that's better. I don't know what the hell the boost does, though. Oh, increases stealth duration. That's actually really good. Okay, that could work. It's a Valhalla terminal, which is fun, don't get me wrong, and disables the computers, which is good, or the, the bots, rather. But... I'm gonna do something else this run. Okay, three shots to get you is not necessarily all that great, and I should probably take a make it. Wish I could mainline that shit. Here's to regular fiend, so I don't need to worry too much about this. Wait for the good shots, and we're good to go. Oh, we need energy leech or something to make sure that I actually get enough energy to stealth more often. Though I think energy leech specifically is about melee kills, so we would definitely have to give it to more of a melee build then. I mean, 9 times 2 is way less than the SMG, of course. But precise could work out. Yeah, okay, whatever. We'll go ahead and do it. It's less damage, but maybe that'll help us out. Somehow. Over here we've got... a okay, guy right there. We can use the long gun for this. In which case, we probably should grab Scavenger pretty soon, then. Does he know I'm here, or is he only attacking the boxes because he's too dumb to know otherwise? We should go on the other side. There's a guy there. I really doubt he's dead, but we can always pray. 75%. I can't seem to hit this guy with two shots. What the actual hell? Push back over the combat pistol. Back to the long rifle. See you in hell, bastards. Okay, key cards we might need, and I need to repair my armor, so I'm gonna do that right now. I don't see anything. Okay, we're not taking the special path, even though I kind of sort of want to. So it's the hub, right? That's right. I think that's right. Go up here and look at this one really quick. This is terminal. Yeah, okay. So it's the hub. Hey, we have cool armor, so that's a start. I mean, it's not as cool as the environmental armor we had, I think that was two runs ago, but still. Uh, yeah, extract and make it. We're gonna need that. No multi tools left, because I haven't picked any up. I've just been kind of just using them as we go. Which works, because it gets our armor repaired, but. Long term solution might not be the best. So this sniper rifle is working out really well. And look at that. Just boom, 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 boom. Uh, give me eagle eyes so I get my max distance up. Which I think we're committing to sniper then, aren't we? His deadly precision requires eagle eye. Could do that. We go gun kata. Or gun runner, which might even be better. Yeah, maybe we go Gunrunner. So let's get. Uh, that means I need Gunslinger. Or Son of a Gun 2. Or I go Gunrunner, and then I get Dash. And more move speed's probably not a bad idea. Okay, let's do Dash. Scavenger might not have been a bad idea either, but it's a little late for that. We'll pick that up maybe next time. And these guys just ran right into my bullets. Like, what was I, what was I was supposed to do? How many 9mm do I actually need is the real question. Two stacks might be enough. If I can actually get, like, a decent stack of hunter ammo on the regular, we might not need to worry about 9mm ammo at all. At least until we actually get, like, Gunrunner up. Hope we're going to be able to get this guy very well. 60%, I guess I'll take it. 
There we go. All they have is 9mm. Okay, combat pistols may be better? Not really. The AV1 combat pistol is better. Okay, so we'll switch over to this right now. What we got here? Um, no vault on this floor, apparently. I guess it's good to know. Mm, don't have a good shot on you with this, but the hunter rifle is much better. Okay. And AV1 pistol is not going to do it. You're going to come to me. Whether you know it or not. There you go. I think we need to switch over. He's going to be pretty close to us. Yeah. The grenade launcher is cool and all, but I don't think it's necessarily going to be helpful. 762 sounds cool, but I don't know if that's helpful to me either. We'll take the smoke grenade. Um, the long revolver is no way that's better than my long gun. Switch over to this little guy here. There no we fucking go. Ammo. Reload. Oh, he had a long gun. No wonder that actually. Or the sniper rifle. I keep calling it a long gun. I keep wanting it to be a long gun, but I guess all sniper rifles kind of are. Reload this. We might need this. This might be a turret. Just a bunch of fiends, actually. That's how we do things. We yeah, didn't even need the long gun there. Okay, so let's grab a multi-tool. I think that's all the red key. Okay, we don't need two stacks of red key cards. That's just silly. That's just silly. What's down here? Anything? Nothing. Okay, so one of these elevators is special, right? This goes to Callisto Rift, which I do not want to do. And over here is the regular one, right? Yeah, Callisto Level 5. And this is the one where we want to take the special... Oh, we got an infestation. Okay, well, let's keep the combat pistol out. Maybe the extra damage will actually help us out here. Not as good as long gun, necessarily, but... Yeah, it does a double fire, which basically means I have... Uh, five shots here. Okay. You think that... Usually takes two shots to take the fiends down anyway. Why does it take an additional two shots to hurt these guys? So wait for these guys to come around the corner a little bit better. There we go. Okay. This is the first time we've actually ever used the combat pistol. We picked it up like once before. Okay, that's our special idea, right? Yeah, we want to go to the docking bay. We picked it up before, but we've always dismissed it, or we haven't had a chance to use it. It's not terrible. It doesn't seem to do too much more damage, though, so I'm not sure if it's actually worth um, dropping a auto rifle for it. I think the auto rifle is actually better. Here's your regular fiend, so I'm just going to wait for you to do that. Somehow he missed me with both of his fireballs, and I have no idea how that happened. We were just lucky, I guess. That wasn't great, but it worked. Um, son of a gun here. Got the optimal range up. I'm bleeding. Medkit will help with that, but I don't have a lot of medkits. Use a stim pack, I guess. Which also helps with bleeding. You good here? I meant local changes, but that would use our last multi tool. I don't really want to do it. Okay, go south. I mean, it's infestation, so all we're going to really see are fiends. We might see the occasional grunt, but 99% of these enemies are all going to be fiends. But there might be special fiends here. Means I might be doomed, but we'll see. Maybe it's just regular fiends. Let these guys come to us. Okay, not too bad, especially with only two of them there. If it was a series of them, I'd have to worry. Oh, I walked right into that. 
Okay, we have two guys directly north of us, but I don't see a door in. Th oh, the door is up on the north as well. Okay, we can do that. I'm kind of surprised they didn't come for me. Oh, that's not the right way. It's over here. And with the door open and everything, they didn't come through. They've got to be able to smell me. Come on, you guys smell me, right? They're just juggling themselves. I guess they're trying to hit me through the wall. That's not going to work, guys. That's not the way doors work. Here we go, maybe. Come on, guys. Just step through the freaking door. They don't want to do it. Okay, well, yeah, they are, in fact, special. Okay. Well, thank goodness I took cover. I don't see it matter at all, but... See you in hell, there we bastards. go. Okay, so we got Fiend's Call Claw for that. 25% slash damage, but minus 25% for all other types. That's really bad. Actually, is it bad? Let's look at this. Yeah, because this is impact. And this is impact. This is pierce, so it doesn't even work for that. Slash, I think, is... I think it's explosion damage. I'm going to drop this. It just seems really bad for what we're trying to do right now. I don't need a damage hit on what I'm trying to do. Alright? It's not going to work for me. Okay, I don't think we've ever been to the docking bay, because there's the vault. I hear a lot of bots stomping around. I don't remember being in the docking bay. Could have been here, I guess. Doesn't sound familiar, though. Okay, 9mm, which I guess is good. We do need some of that. Okay. That seems like a little bit of a cheat to be able to do this, but they're going to let us. We can just aim around the wall here. Any more fiends want to let me just poke them? I'm okay with that. Um, that's not really going to work. Let me back up here. You seem to be able to do it. Okay, no, we're good. So far, so good. Okay, you bashed right through there. I was not expecting that. Um, he's going to hit me here, isn't he? I don't think we can really do much about that. So we move to their combat knife. And back up. And then attack him. Switch back over and reload. I feel like I'm running a little low on ammo here, but maybe we're okay. Can I go here? Nope. Uh, shotgun shells are not going to help me. The frag grenade might. Anything around the corner I can poke at? Come on. Beans, you going to poke your heads out? No such luck. Okay. I mean, I hear fiends over there, so I know they're there. Another red key card, which I do not need. I hear another bot over here. Actually, is it over here, or is it... No, it's a fiend. Level 6. Definitely take Gunrunner. Yeah. When you move, you prep for attack, so you attack faster. Okay. Need to reload. Okay, well, that was all of them. That seemed too easy. Not need the shotgun ammo. Yeah, I'm running low on pistol ammo. More than I'd like to admit. The stim. Oh, that opened this side, didn't it? I think it did. Now all these doors are open. I've definitely never been here before. Okay, so red key cards are used for these. So maybe two stacks of red key cards is actually not a bad idea. Um, unlock the north sector. I mean, lockdown will give us something. Maybe more Reiki cards? Let's try it. Lockdown initiated. So, yeah, we've got guys coming from the elevator, which is not surprising. Uh, theoretically, they know right where I am. So, let's wait right here for them to come to us. Actually, now we have the grenade. Chuck it in the mix there. 
Okay, well, they dropped a cool helmet. Supply visor. I have no idea. Grants plus one charge to any access terminal and station. Also does a name action bonus. Reveals turrets and bots on the minimap. Okay. Sounds cool. I'm going to pick up that red key card because we might need that. Come up here and unlock this. Unlock the south sector as well, because why the hell not? Okay. So down here, what do we got? This is probably the north sector, if I had to guess. Uh, cool 9mm calibrated. Fresh mag 4. Valve sec would be good against bots. I don't know what master calibration does, but decent damage. Less damage than our current AB1, but... Might be worth it. Let's see what it does. 50% critical chance within optimal distance. It's actually not bad at all. Bonus damage on a full magazine. Since we have run and gun, that's actually more likely. Yeah, okay, maybe. Um, do we actually have the ability? Ah. Son of a gun. You can bonuses to pistol ranges. Okay. But then on Gunslinger. Okay, so we need Gunslinger, so... We don't need Gunslinger, but it could work out. Yeah, so this will let us have two SMGs or pistols or revolvers. It actually wouldn't be bad at all. So we don't have that yet, so we'll go ahead and leave this behind. Do we leave this behind? We've used the combat knife fairly recently. It's helped us, so I don't want to give it up yet. Okay, we'll the hunter rifle. Use the calibrated gun for now. What do we got in here? Another gun. Get that accuracy mod pack on my non-millimeter calibrated. Give that optimal range up. Molten. If I go gunslinger... Kind of weird, but maybe? I mean, we're, if we're gonna go Gunslinger, this might not be a horrible thought. Uses two different kinds of ammo, which might hurt, but... I don't know. Marine armor. Yeah, okay. I mean, the camo boost is cool, but Painkiller and Padded actually sounds good. Okay, let's see what's in the south region. Here we've got a shock, two shotguns. Dual building shotgun sounds awesome. I wonder if that's actually a thing we can do. And the marine helmet, but I don't know, the supply axis sounds really cool. So we'll keep the supply axis for right now. Oh, the Abelado is probably better, isn't it? Uh, the protection definitely is. Durability definitely is. The dodge definitely is. Yeah, okay. Just out of curiosity. Ooh, can't be repaired. No. No, 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 no. I'm going to take something that, that can be repaired instead, because that's like a far better option. Okay. Well, we didn't need the right key cards like I thought we did, but we did okay there. Okay, so now we just go ahead. Well, make sure to grab that, um, that box over there, which I totally missed out on. Okay, 9mm ammo, which I do need. And then let's get out of here. Might need to pick up Scavenger pretty soon. Gunslinger wouldn't be bad, but we'll see. Okay, so I have enough to get to see bots around. So that's not everybody, though. It's a risk, though, that I'm going to think it's everybody. Well, this does pretty good damage. It's not necessarily as good as a sniper rifle, but still pretty good. Back up over here. There you go. Let them come to you. Okay, we're doing excellent damage here. It's almost like everything is a bot. That's how much good damage we're doing. Give me good, st good stacks here. 44 ammo is good too. But we'll pick that up in a minute. Wow, did we just take out all the bot there? That was amazing. Maybe pistols can be excellent. I've been wasting all these bullets on SMGs like that's supposed to help me out, but 
here looks like we're doing fantastic. That's pretty good. I'm not even need grenades. I mean, that's probably crazy talk. That's a vault. We'll need 9mm. Great. Grenade. Great. Yeah, I'm loving the pistol run here. That's really working out. Wow, single shot on a big droid like that. That's amazing. There we go. Don't really need the 762, but I mean maybe later for sure, but not now. Get your good. Uh the blue here is the exit, right? Yeah, okay, that's our way out. Uh, might as well go ahead and unlock the vault. I'll have to go back anyway. And give me a med kit. Maybe another one. There you go. I mean, I can't really trust my play. Like, I wish I was good enough to not have to rely on my kits, but they're a resource for a reason. Okay, so now we go into the vault. Um, you know what? I'll look at the armor later. Right now, we've got to, you know, not get shot. See you there. 200%. So we'll take. You guys are just going to come out. Ooh, the accurate armor is going to be difficult. So the 200% was pretty good. All right, let's see if we can pull him over here. That seems likely, right? It did work out. Oh, he has 762 ammo. Well, that's going to be real tricky. Okay, this is really bad. Well, at least they know we're here, so that actually might be okay. Okay, he dropped an amp. Fucking reload already. That's actually pretty good. Three guys left. Uh, yeah, get the utility amp. What do we got? Okay, camo boost. They really want to give me a camo boost, don't they? Metabolic boost might not be bad. That might actually combine with the uh, with the running gun. We'll see. That hunker down actually worked out great. We totally can get you there. And stay down. And there you go. Motherfucker. Okay, get gunslinger so we can use two bolt two revolvers at the same time. So I think much as I would love to have the 44. We've got to have like two good nine millimeters right now. I don't know about having a 44. Because the thing is, I don't have very much ammo for it. Yeah, I kinda hate doing it. Hopefully we'll be able to mod oh, actually we got a good mod right here. I get the combat pistol and then calibrate it. Actually, we need to have these combined. How we need to put these together? Okay, hold on. They need to be next to each other, otherwise this won't work. So drop this and drop this. Grab the calibrated there. Pick you up, and then you up, and that should work. I keep doing that wrong. Okay. And pick up this first, and then oops, that's wrong, isn't it? Okay, there we go. There we go. Now we see both of them there. Our guy is wielding two guns at once. No it's actually more. great. Okay. Probably want a lot more bullets than we don't need the 44 ammo. Or do we? I'm just wondering if maybe we want to change over to a long gun. Maybe drop the melee. Lean heavily into our dual pistol madness and then melee is an absolute backup or do we want the 44 as the sniper rifle I do the 44 as a sniper rifle maybe just one stack of 44 though like that's 50 right there so give me a give me a give me a sniper rifle instead of the combat knife and we have the... For some reason, not dual wielding anymore. I don't know why. There we go. Okay, so we don't need any more 44. We just need 9mm. It's over here. Box full of 9mm. Good. Okay. Four stacks should be more than enough for 9mm. Let's go deal with the boss man here. See if we can actually, like, you know, not die. That'd be spiffy keen. Spaceport. 
Hope there's a working dropship here. I mean, that was pretty sweet. I mean, we're going through a lot more... Actually, are we doing a lot more... I wonder if we were using actually more bullets than SMG, but we might not be. It's definitely more precise than an SMG. This might actually be better. As much as I would love to do something there, I don't think we can. Uh, pipe wrench is cool, but I don't think it's going to work. Definitely get the multi-tool. What we got over here? Okay, 60, 100. We've got a chance there. Actually, yeah, they're both down. That was pretty good. If we can take down the sentry turrets in a single blow. That might make it worth it just by itself. Might as well unlock this, because what the hell. Don't have to come back here. Oh, over here. I'll grab this. Uh, let's see. AV1 combat pistol. Might be better than this. Um, that might be right, right? That's barbed. That'll make him bleed. For the shot, so to speak. Okay, 30% there. There's no real way. Though that might actually take him out if we just tonk her down here. There we go. That's actually great. I'm loving this dual pistol nonsense. It's great nonsense in my favor. Which is the kind of nonsense I'm really for. Okay. We might not need the sniper rifle. I mean, that might be crazy talk. We'll we'll hold off and see. Right now, though, I'm feeling pretty good. Okay, we got some bots up here, but I'm wondering... Oh, the one problem we're going to have... The one problem that could really knock us out here... Is that we hit the threshold. Okay, I did walk right into that, I'll admit. Um, this bad guy over here we should take care of. Yeah, if we hit the, the bulwark threshold, we're going to be pelted on all sides by lots and lots and lots of explosions all over the place that we do not really have a defense against. So that could be an issue if we hit the damage threshold. Hopefully not. Uh, it seems pretty likely, though, doesn't it? It does seem pretty likely we're going to hit that damage threshold. Let's, let's see what happens. Okay, there he is. Ooh, yeah. See, the damage, 30 right there. That's a problem. Let's tuck in over here. Yeah, that could be a problem. Let's switch over to the hunter rifle right now. Now, yeah, see, crit 30. We're still going to have a problem there. I'm still in 35%, but that's not really going to work. So we want to just one pistol at a time. Oh, this is still going to be damage 30, isn't it? Ugh. It's possible. Yeah, this critted him. That was bad. And we can just go ahead and keep on hitting him here, but we are so incredibly dead. We're actually too good. That's what that's where our problem is right now. We're doing too well. Yeah, we keep on doing bulwark there. I guess we just keep on shooting him, but but we are so gonna die if we're not careful here. Keep on eating those of my kids. Eat them like candy. On the upside, he's dying quickly, which is good. On the downside, I almost died. Eat that large my kit straight off. Eat those, and I guess this could be better. Actually, inventory slot. Increase energy gain on box open. Okay, sure, why not? We'll keep this. We lived. I kind of thought we were going to die, but we lived. Okay, now that we don't have to worry about a bulwark anymore, more damage is good. We just need better pistols, but that's a side issue. Maybe here I'll get some answers. Um, there's a bad guy right around the bend. Come on, I know you guys are just outside of my visible range. There you go. Okay, pick that up. You're probably dead. I like that it actually worked there. I wasn't expecting that to work. Okay, so the hunter rifles. Ooh, okay, sure, why not? We'll trade it out. We've only got a stack of 44 ammo. 
We'll drop that and pick up a stack of that instead. Okay, switch back over. That's how we do things downtown. Okay, so we have a stack of 762 that I don't even know if we're gonna need. But we might as well try it. Yeah, sure, why should I get why not? Don't need any of that. The 762 is gonna be more popular anyway. Gonna get some oh, I guess the 9mm drops are not happening that often anymore there. MP grenade is gonna be good. Um maybe we go ahead and trade the sniper rifle for melee. And then we're gonna start needing. And we're gonna need 762 is what we're gonna need. We need 762 pistols at some point. Well, here's your chance. Yeah, we can get 762 sidearms right here. Let's get two of those. Um, we did trade out a little bit there, but let's move there and pick up this. And then we should be able to use two 762s. Okay. So now all our weapons use 762, which is questionable, I'll admit, but we're going to get we get scavenger we can actually do very very well here uh, we seem to get scavenger so that's our plan scavenger is our plan we have melee as a backup just in case but scavenger is our plan right now okay, now there's a guy over here oh okay drop more 762 for me why not Okay, you're not gonna really help me there. I mean, I guess I could add multiple or commit local changes, but I don't know what the deck that's gonna do. Actually, gonna come through there, or are you just playing with me? Two rounds there is pretty good. Do I have cover against this guy? I think I do. Okay, let's get Scavenger so we can get a lot more 7.62 ammo. And we're gonna need it. So the 9mm change is over, which is great, and we can't actually carry anymore. Oh, because I've got full 9mm ammo. Well, that's okay, because that'll change over to 7.62 now. So that's actually great that I saved that. It was totally in my plan and not at all a mistake. Oh, except I can't do that yet. Because I don't have scavenger level 2, which lets me upgrade to 7.62. So I need to level up again. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, grab my mod pack. Create a mod pack here. Give me a power pack. You don't need to carry it. That's okay. Auto calibrate one of my sword arms, so at least I can tell the difference between the two. And then pick that up and do it on this one. And we'll do fresh mag here. So we can't actually turn this to 762 yet. But we will. Just, you know, we have to wait a little bit. So tempted to make one of these a 9mm, but we don't actually. Maybe. Might not be a horrible idea. Kinda hate to do it though. Well, that didn't really work, did I? I ran right into that guy. Fortunately we still have a lot of health. Okay, none of these guys are gonna drop 7.62 from it though. I guess the turret did, which is good. He's mean the 70s at least. Anything on the side? We might see somebody over here. Oh, they're Ravager. I'm gonna hunker first. Which actually didn't help me much. Still three goes there to be able to do that. That's true whether it's an SMG or it's this. Up. So I don't know. At least we're hitting on the regular here. I don't need to worry too much about hitting. It's oh, just... new toys. I mean, that's cool. Don't get me wrong. Well, I have Zombie Bane on this equipment, though, so I don't want to get rid of that. I mean, the unflinching game sounds awesome. And look at that damage. Look at that damage. 
Okay, you know what? This might actually help me so I don't go through armor or through ammo too much. Is I have some 762. We dropped the 9mm. But this way I can have 44. I have just the 44. No. Let's see if we trade the. Okay, we can turn this into 44 ammo, which is actually great. That helps. Then I don't burn through the 762 quite as fast. Um, hunker okay, down here. Actually, maybe back up. Let these guys come to us. At least one of them's gonna come to me. Which I'll take. Um, there's no way I hit you with this. You might not down some boxes. You fired at me, so you know I'm here. You come to me. There you go. 762, I appreciate that. And this is a turret, right? So we want to go around the long way, I think. Yeah. Hunker down. Take a shot. Blood for the blood god. Okay. Could be worse. Oh, Shazbot. It's turning the 762 ammo that I pick up into 44 ammo. Crap on a stick. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's stupid, but it's fine. It's using the, the designation of what I have in the slot there, which makes sense. It's just stupid. Okay, do I want to go to Europe level 3? Let's look at the computer here first. Uh, the computer's down here. So switch over to just 762. Pick that up. What do we got? Dig zone, ruins, mysterious habitat, refueling base. We've been to all these types. Um... Let's go ahead and try the dig zone. I think I usually die in the dig zone, but hopefully not this time. Take that out. Back up, back up, back up. Back. We're too many bad guys here. Yeah, 87 is pretty good. I'll take that. Do you have that reaver to worry about? Maybe not. That rocket's a little crazy, though. Okay, good. You're dead. Okay. Just kill the turret. That's easy. Ravager less so. <clears throat> Nearly murdered me. Take a stim pack. Okay. You want that 762? You've got to actually equip only your 762 to pick it up. Back over. Oh, he's got a 762 as well. Okay. We're good. Uh, blow those up for me, will ya? Actually, trade over to. That doesn't actually matter. Blow it up. Okay. Wait for a good shot. There you go. Don't need 9mm. 44 ammo wouldn't be terrible. We don't really need it, though. I mean, you're right next to some explosives. Do you want to just blow this up for me? <laughs> Down here first on the Cryo Reaver. I think we might actually be doomed here. Might have actually just walked into a huge fucking mess. Yep. <laughs> walked into a giant, giant, giant mess. Okay, so the problem with dual wielding is it only, and dual wielding and scavenger, is that it only scavenges the right ammo for the weapon on top. Which is quite the trick. That is quite the catch. But now we know, and hopefully we remember that for next time. For now, thanks for watching. This has been Jupiter Hell on PC Universe here, PC Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.